afternoon plant the seed and you shall receive um today i would like to just talk to you guys i'm about just listening sometimes in life we have to just listen we have to listen to the holy spirit and that's what i'm learning i'm learning that in life instead of just asking for things be patient and listen to god because sometimes He'll be revealing the answers to us, but we don't take time to listen. So I'm telling you guys, if you're expecting anything from God, if you're um, if you've been praying for something, take time to listen. Listen to our heavenly Father because He has a lot in store for us. I was just looking at this movie. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, looking at this movie. Um. Evan Almighty or something like that. And it was pertaining to um, Noah's art. And it really caught my attention because, you know, in the Bible, when God told Noah to um, build the ark, he had to listen. And in life, that's what we have to do. We have to listen. Because if we just continue to do what we want to do and continue to just live life how we want to live, we're never going to get the answer. So I'm telling you guys, listen. Listen like Noah did. God has something to tell you. He has something in store for you. But we have to take time and listen. I'm I'm being very patient with God um because not only we have to realize that God has a lot in store for us but sometimes we just have to be patient with God knowing that his time is not our time knowing that we just have to have faith and believe that he's going to work out everything that we're asking for So today, right now, I'm asking you guys to just listen, meditate. You know, I took time today and I meditated. I meditated and I just, you know, I closed my eyes and I just, I let go and I let God lead me. And sometimes in life, we have to. We be so in in a rush to just do a lot of things and we don't never just listen. We, we are so quick to just ask and ask and ask, but never have patience to just listen because the questions that we ask, our Heavenly Father already know what we want. So I'm letting you guys know today, take time and listen, pray. After you pray, listen, let go and let God have his way. You know, I think about a lot of things and I think back on how far God has brought me. And then I think like if he did it back then, I know he can do it again. And I know um, some people can be, you know, impatient. They can't wait. But when we're dealing with our Heavenly Father, we have to have patience. We have to believe that He will do exactly what He said He's going to do. I know some, I mean, me personally, I know I get impatient a lot. But I'm learning as I grow that my timing is not God's timing. And His timing is not my timing. And we have to just trust in him and believe that he's going to work it out no matter what, no matter how long it takes. You know, um, Sunday, which was Resurrection Day, I was down. I was so down. I I felt like, you know, um, I was just so overwhelmed and I was just like I was just going through a lot of things and. 
I was taking so much stuff in and, you know, a lot of stuff has been happening like at once, you know, and I was just, I was just so confused, you know, but when I went to church, you know, I was down, but then as the, the bishop began to preach, um, I began to, um, it began to uplift my spirit, you know, no matter what's going on in your life, um, pray about it, let go and let God have his way, because I believe that everything that happens in our life, um, it was already written, it was already written, this, there is nothing that, that we can control or stop, because once our life has been written, we have to just let go and let God, you know, but I've been going through a lot and I know we're going to, we're going to continue to go through things here on this earth. You know, that's life. That's life. There's nothing we can do about it, but just pray and ask God to just lead us and guide us. And I'm just going to continue to pray. I'm going to continue to have faith. Um, no matter how hard it gets. I know where my health and my strength coming from. And I'm just, I'm thankful. I'm thankful and I'm going to continue to listen to God because I know he knows what's best for me. He's brought me a mighty long way. I didn't do it by myself. I know he, he deserves all the glory and all the praise. So what I'm telling you guys today no matter what you're facing, no matter what you're going through, just listen. When you pray, listen. Listen. And I guarantee you, God will reveal everything to you. I want to say thank you guys for watching the video. Um, just continue to pray. Continue to keep me in your prayers as I continue to keep you guys in my prayers. And I just thank you guys so much. Until next time, you guys continue to plant the seed and you will receive God's blessings. Thanks for watching. Until next time, be blessed.